the Maybelline Fit Me Foundation that was in matte plus poreless and then now I'm going in with my LA Girl Pro Concealer. This is in the color Warm Honey. makeup the first time my um, eyeshadow this inner part was popping a little bit more so I already know the trick of what I need to do I'm gonna add a little bit of water to some brush to try to get that to look exactly like how I had it before I'm taking the LA girl setting powder and I'm using that to go ahead and set my under eye. And I also, after I finish blending this out, I'm gonna go back to all the areas where I apply concealer so I can make sure those areas are set. don't let my setting powder sit too long but I'm gonna quickly leave that on so I can go ahead and contour using my black radiance contour palette and this is the light to medium palette using also my real techniques contouring brush and just going ahead and contouring this face up go in with my Rimmel London Scandal Eyes Waterproof Coal Mask Coal Eyeliner. It's so tough for me to try to smudge this on camera. I, I just, it's hard for me. I don't see how people do it. Real Lash Paradise Mascara. Putting that down at the bottom. For my blush, I'm going in with Maybelline Fit Me's blush. This is in the color Wine, number 50. And I'm just gonna apply that to the apples of my cheeks. So I'm just gonna go in with this blush here. else I'm gonna apply a little bit of my black radiance true complexion this is a soft focus finishing powder and I'm just gonna press that into my skin like in the lower areas here kind of even where the contour was at I don't I never mind um, putting that on the contour because I feel like it just gives the look a natural finish I love highlighting using my mineralized skin finish and gold deposit. So I love highlighting using this. And I'm gonna go ahead and apply that highlight nose. I'm applying this first onto my skin. Um, very lightly, but then I'm gonna go back in over it with another highlight. And I'm gonna season this as my, like my start off. To finish it off, I'm going in with Wet n Wild highlighting powder and Precious Petals, and I'm going to go ahead and apply that on top. Now that highlight is done, I'm going in with 
three lipsticks you guys and that's because one of the lipsticks I'm using as a liner the other two are gonna go into the center so you guys know if you've been following me on my IG and if you you know just been following me on here you guys know I like to every so often customize shades that I already have I feel like I have a lot of lipsticks that I don't even use so the ones that I do have I can create so many different looks and so many different colors with them I like to customize my shade just depending on what makeup look I'm going for perfect tone matte lip creams from black radiance the first one is bronze sugar I believe and the other one is uh, very naked so I'm gonna use these two colors here the bronze sugar I'm going to be using that as a lip liner and then this one here very naked I'm going in with in the center and then also to top off the whole look I'm going to go in with exotic and this is an NYX lingerie lipstick I'm going to end the whole lipstick look with this color here so let's go ahead and get started with the lip so I like to use the darkest shade as my lip liner. Then I'm gonna go in with Very Naked by Black Radiance right in the center. Okay, and so that already looks really, really pretty like that. But then I like to go ahead and finish it off with the exotic color. And that's pretty much the finished look. 